Hey, this is Doug from Doug and Nikki here in the outdoor testing studio with a cool new boat. Check this out. It's a shark from DERC. This is like a beginner RC boat with a ton of advanced features that you want. So let's do this. Let me show you what it looks like. I'll talk to you about the features in the background, then we'll come back do a Doug score from one to five, let you know how it was. And then if you want to hang around at the end, I'll unbox it, show you what comes in it. All right, let's go play with it. All right, so things you want to know about this, it has this cool graphics, this shark graphics. I'm sure you can tell it looks cool in the water there. Another really cool like, kind of advanced feature about it is it has fully proportional throttle, speed regulation, steering. So it's much more high performance control, that kind of thing. So obviously it's made out of ABS pla plastic with a waterproof cover. Even though it's waterproof, it's easy to get in and out of it, which I like. DERC has a new circulation kind of cooling method where it should give you a longer run time and more durability with the boat. Theoretically, you're supposed to be able to get up and over 20 miles an hour with it. I'll talk to you about that in my review. Communications are 2.4 gigahertz, which allows you to operate with other boats around without having interference and that kind of stuff. And you're supposed to get a range of 328 feet, which I don't know where you're going 328 feet away from you with this little toy boat, but it is amazing. It's a testament to the quality of things that you can do that. All right, I think those are the things you wanna know about it. You see it running. Let's go do that review. All right, so you've been watching the play. You heard about its features. Let's talk review. Okay, so this is really interesting. This is the shark from DERC. Love the paint scheme. Kind of like the size. I'm having a couple little problems with this. Let's talk about the basic things, right? Function wise, it motors, does great, goes really fast for its size. I was a little nervous that it only had one battery, but I kind of played with it and played with it and played with it. Finally started to run low, recharged it. It's one battery is just fine for this. I was also a little nervous that the battery is not like snapped down in any way in there. Again, made no difference to the performance, worked perfectly. They're clearly smarter than a fifth grader. My one concern in terms of a fifth grader, watch this. That's a little creepy to me. Normally these things turn off and on when they're in the water. This one does not. Once you put that battery in, you got power going to that uh, blade back there. Now. As adults, I, I, I'm pretty careful about it and I can be reasonable. I would just be a little concerned if you were talking about a younger kid or even if I was playing out here with some kids and they went to grab it. I don't know, just the thing with me. Um, I don't know if it's a make or break thing. I don't even know if it would hurt you or not. I don't know how, I don't know how powerful it is, but that I am not gonna test out. And then the one other thing that I found is I found that the propeller did get fouled a lot. Um, could just be the time of year, could be there's a lot of seaweed or something in there and it was never any problem. Like you'd just be driving along, all of a sudden it's like brrrr, it starts going to the one side. You just throw it in reverse for two minutes, hit the throttle again, you're good. So a little bit of an annoyance. I don't know if it's a design thing in terms of where the propeller is or the shape or any of that kind of stuff, but um, was no issue whatsoever. Worked perfectly, had no problems. Loved it, had a ton of fun with it. So I'm gonna give this Four, what are they called on props? Four blades. Four blades out of five on the Doug score. Say I really enjoyed it, my only qualm at all is that. Other than that, super cool. Hope this was helpful. We'll see you next time.